right guys hey i'm outside messing around with my saddle hunting gear and i want to take just a moment to talk to you about improving the comfort on your tethered mantis saddle so if you have been following the forums or been online it's not a secret that there were two main flaws with the tethered mantis the one was when you were sitting down it would it would by nature of the design want to ride up on you and the second thing the most important thing was the hip pinch made it terrible <laughs> it was just super uncomfortable because of how much hip pinch was induced again by the nature of the design i did a, a highlight between the mantis and the h2 and basically deducted that the tethered mantis the hip loops do not come past my hip and so if this material the mesh material was extended around my waist and then the hip loops out past my hip that would take away all of that hip pinch that I was feeling so it, it would be just like my h2 saddle so um, obviously it's made and we can't go back and remake it like that and of course as I'm playing around I got the the new tethered phantom so they have already improved it and did exactly what I'm talking about here um, but what about those that still have the tethered mantis is it is it a waste do you need to just get rid of it is it that uncomfortable there is a a option or a solution for the hip pinch that you get with the tethered mantis and it's the same option and solution that will help it from riding up on you when you're sitting in the tree and so I've been playing around and I took my triad bridge off my h2 saddle and I put it on the mantis and it did three things three things that will totally change the way the tethered mantis feels the first thing it did is the the the, the stock or the factory bridge is only a 24 inch bridge whereas the triad bridge is a 30 inch bridge and it's fully adjustable as well if that's too long or too too long you can shorten it as well the second thing that the triad bridge does is it it technically extends your hip loops by at least four to four and a half inches because of this continuous loop of amsteel that's turned into a prusik knot and so again when i sit down you'll see that the hip loops are extended by at least four inches which again that changes that changes the pitch of the hip loops and it's not pinching on my waist as much as it, it was if I was anchored back here on the hip loop. But the third thing it does, and maybe the most important thing, is this triad bridge, because of the Prusik knot, I can adjust it anywhere I want infinity on my hip loop. Even I can take this brown webbing and I can crunch it and I could slide that Prusik knot all the way down to to the, the very the very bottom part of this uh, saddle and so if I was to lock up here and you'll see so I'll lock up and I'll put this saddle I'll put it uh, let's just say right in the middle maybe slightly above the middle um, where, where the the bridge would normally be when I sit down even with the extended hip loops I can't get my hand in here one because my love handles are growing bigger but two just because of how much pressure uh, it puts on me now if I take the pressure off which is the benefit of a triad bridge I can slide it all the way down the bottom again I could go another two and a half inches on this all the way down but now when I sit down it completely changes the pressure load I feel no pressure right here you can see I got no pressure right there it is all now down here around the base of my butt or somewhat on my thighs and it kind of makes me feel like I'm sitting on a swing or something like that versus having all that hip pinch. There's no hip pinch. And it literally has changed the entire way this tethered mantis feels. And so um, if I would have had the triad bridge whenever I first was using it, I probably would have kept the mantis. Uh, and so again, if you are looking at a saddle, but you hear negative reviews, you know, they're uncomfortable, consider picking yourself up a mantis and adding the triad bridge it's $25 go over to h2 saddles you can pick it up for $25 and I'm telling you it's going to change the way this thing feels and so hunters helping hunters out that's how we all get better and uh, this was just one of the improvements that I have found for this tethered mantis anyway hey good luck to you all and uh, if you want to know a little bit more about this triad bridge I have a video dedicated uh, to it alone over on my channel and if you want to look at my reviews or the highlights between this and the H2, that's also over there as well. Anyway, thanks for watching.